black-winged stilt is a widely distributed very long-legged wader in the avocet and stilt family. It is sometimes called pied stilt, but that name is now reserved for the Australian species. Adults are 33 to 36 centimeters long. They have long pink legs, a long thin black bill and are blackish above and white below, with a white head and neck with a varying amount of black. Males have a black back, often with greenish gloss. Females' backs have a brown hue, contrasting with the black remiges. In the populations that have the top of the head normally white at least in winter, Females tend to have less black on head and neck all the year, while males often have much black, particularly in summer. Males usually get all white heads in winter. Immature birds are gray instead of black and have a markedly sandy hue on the wings, with light feather fringes appearing as a whitish line in flight. The breeding habitat of all these stilts is marshes, shallow lakes, and ponds. Some populations are migratory and move to the ocean coasts in winter, those in warmer regions are generally resident or short-range vagrants. In Europe, the black-winged stilt is a regular spring overshoot vagrant north of its normal range, occasionally remaining to breed in northern European countries. These birds pick up their food from sand or water. They mainly eat insects and crustaceans. When they are not resting or preening, black neck stilts spend much of the day wading in shallow waters to capture aquatic invertebrates, small crustaceans, amphibians, snails, and tiny fish. They prey on larval mosquitoes, soldier flies, brine flies, caddis flies, dragon flies, mayflies, crickets, grasshoppers, many kinds of beetles, water boatmen, crayfish, brine shrimp, tadpoles, and very small frogs and fish. These are captured with a quick peck, sometimes with the head partly, submerged. Sometimes, they swing the bill side to side in the water, much as avocets do, to skim invertebrates from the surface or just below the surface. To capture small fish, they sometimes chase them into the shallows, where the fish become trapped. Seeds and vegetation form a tiny part of the diet. They look for places with soft sand or other substrate that can be scraped away to form the nesting depression.
The nests are often set among vegetation stubble adjacent to water or on dikes, islands, or high spots with sparse vegetation such as glasswort and salt grass. The nest site is a bare spot on the ground near water. These birds often nest in small groups, sometimes with avocets. Males and females share the work of nest construction. All the nests will be raised close together. The group will also take care of the nests. Black neck stilts are especially animated during the breeding season, when females select males for mating. They usually lay two to five eggs. The egg is a tawny olive to light drab with dark brown speckling. Both sexes participate in incubation and chick rearing, though males appear to accompany older chicks more often than females. The pair bond is maintained through nesting and chick rearing, but if a nest fails, stilts sometimes begin again with a different mate. Adult stilts are highly territorial. Males often challenge one another early in the nesting season, stretching out into upright stances, or racing at each other with necks contracted and tails raised. Intense conflicts sometimes involve aerial combat in which males strike each other. Adults sometimes attack still chicks that are not their own chicks. Small chicks can dive and swim underwater to avoid hostile adults and predators. The black-winged stilt is one of the species to which the Agreement on the Conservation of African Eurasian Migratory Waterbirds applies.